Hey there, hi there, hi here. Welcome if you're new. Gina Gay at your service. This is a preview pre-sale. Oh, ah, shoot. Video for Taco Tuesday. That will be September the 19th. And today is Sunday. It's really not Saturday over here. But I figured let me do this and get it done. And that way it's ready to go tomorrow. This, I don't know. This is going to just stay around. Because why are we not focused? Uh, stop looking at my background camera. Wait, hold on. Oh my god. Why is this cockeyed? I have to do that to get it focused? My god, man. Alright, it's just in here. Sorry. But this is for sale. Oh, sadly. This is vintage John Wind. Um, it was for me. It's a little... Oh my gosh, what's happening? Why isn't anything focusing? It's ridiculous. See the, the wear on this? But, you know, you've seen the kind. I've owned the kind. We all know the kind that people cobble together. You know, all due respect, but they're not this. You know, they cobble together the little watches. They make a necklace or a bracelet. And it's like, oh, okay, look at you crafty. This one is gorgeous. And it's really, like, I looked at it. I sussed it out when I got it. Like, is there? Could I? And it's like, no. There's no way for me to make this smaller. I will measure it. Does the safety class come off? I will not measure it because the safety class doesn't come off. And those, you know, the bracelet mandrels, I had the $40 kind. I gave it to Jessica because it's fairly useless. Um, let me put it on my wrist. It's at least a seven and a half inch. Wait, hold on. I've got too many rings catching on the safety chain. Let me see how we could do this. How can we do this? Oh, I'll just open it. Oh my god, why am I acting like I gotta slide it over my wrist? Godness, Jane. I'm just godness. So this is a honker stomper. Is what this is. And that is why I got this. Yeah, no, probably seven and three quarters. Because look. And it could slide right on off. Right on off? My wrist. I have a six inch wrist if you're new. You know what I'm saying? But I'm wearing like a lot of kind of rings. So let me do this. There. <sighs> Much to my dismay. John Wynn, you can look him up. You won't find this one. But you can see the things he does. Ugh. Just, I was really sad about this. I still am. That's why I'm still playing with it. Boo! That's what I have to say about that. I still have this ring. This is mine. It's beautiful. It's a slabby, druzy. Um, I think I wore it. Oh, look. So I was already wearing these rings. And then this one came in from Deb because I'm an old time bullseye agate person and it's too big but it's weirdly sitting there and it just kind of went with everything today i'm like oh my god come on now i mean that one doesn't really go but you know overlook that right it's fantastic saddle rings i kind of introduced those as well to the u of tube the tube of u but we're back to this one it's about a seven it might be say something else on the mandrel because these are also not very reliable. Yeah, it says this. It fits a little bit bigger than that, at least on me. So I would say six and three quarters to be on the safe side. It is all sterling. It is fantastic. Oh, I forgot I cooked potatoes. Do you hear the beep, 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 beep? The beep, 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 beep. I don't know why this ring of mine is in here. No clue. Not a clue. Oh, maybe I was showing you that it looks like the same person that did those. 
It's French. It's probably the Francais. Remember, see, I told you, like, these lips the same as these? Does it not? What are the chances? I got these years ago. This I got more like a year ago. Okay. That's kind of boring a little bit. Um, where do we go? Where do we go now? If you watch my videos, you saw me pick this up at the antique store. It's 1940s, sort of Victorian revival. It is not sterling. Wait, hold on. But it's just fabulous. It's fabulous. It's lost on me. But I just, you know, I couldn't not get it because it's like all of that buttery and book chainy. Mm, the length. I guess we could measure that. It fits me perfectly. Oh, I gotta have a measuring thing. Oh, I didn't bring my good ruler. Where's my soft? There's my soft measure. There it is. Hang on. Oh, land. Oh, land. Love is in. Always on time. I have the doors open because it's kind of. Alexa, what's the temperature? She's not going to answer me. She never does. She got it in for me. It's about 16 and a half inches because there's a little curve to it, you know, so it's not going to go straight when I measure it, come dead straight like the chain does. Anyways, it's beautiful. Yeah, I don't know what the measure, the measurement, the weather is, but it's cool enough to keep the doors open. Let's just say that. And Chochi's enjoying it, although he should be going down for his nap. It's that time of day. We've got these at the antique store, just antique check glass, and I just kept that so to keep them together. Keep, keep it together. Keep it together. What are you doing? Ever and ever. Just lovely old things. Okay. I'm afraid to put them anywhere because I feel like they're going to get lost. They're going to get lost. I decided to sell both of these. They go together. You don't have to buy them together, but... Now, here's the thing. Here's the story of a lovely lady. It came to me, back when it came to me, it was way too big. Like, if you put this on, it's like almost an anklet, right? But you can put these back on, and anybody can do it. If I can do it. Let me trust you. Let me trust you. Trust me. You just pull those off, right? They're just like little puzzles. Anyways, I will sell it, including that. You can put it bigger if you want. It's right now. I'm a six inch. Let's see what it says. It's about six and three quarters. Um, it's just super cool. I mean, you don't have to buy them together, but just because I wore them together. It's not a law. This is the more recent. Little book chainy. This one's a little bigger. Lots of seven inches, but you could add to this one, right? Oh, shut up, microwave. There's the... Tingly dangly. They just look good together. You know what I'm saying? I've got a bunch of old brass bracelets that I wear together. Brass combined with gold filled. Keep, keep it together forever and ever. Yeah, I'm allowed to change the melody. Melody. Um, this is, I, I should just come out here with no jewelry on. It would make my life a lot easier. Seven, seven inches sterling. Uh, ammonite, I think that's pyrite. Whoa doggy, it's a whoa doggy. Keep, keep it together. Sweet little butterfly amber sterling ring. I don't know the size. What are you eating right now? What are you just picking up off the floor? Freak Boy Slim, another size seven. OK, 
Okay. Don't just scrap you off the floor. Bruh. That's enough, bruh. What? It's gonna go. What do you oh my god, what's down there? <laughs> There's no like stray food. And it's also not his treat, so I don't know. It's not bugs. Biggity bug bug. Hey, oh. Don't you do it. He just keep, what are you eating? Maybe he is finding. I think he's so desperate because I'm not feeding him treats. He's finding like, you know how when you, when you, when they eat their treats and then there's little kibble left, like little bits that they don't quite, oh no, it's no boy, no. Okay, this is vintage. It is not sterling. Oh dear. It is amber and it is that. I guess I didn't really need the bust because it's not, this has been, one of these has been replaced, that one. Um, I would glow it, but I didn't bring my thing in and it's amber, so just know that. It's very unusual. It's very cool. It's very interesting. Sweater clip, double brooch, however you want to wear it. Make your own kind of music, sing your own special song. Even if nobody else sings along. I've had several of these over the years. This is just vintage um, glass. It's not garnet. Sterling, though. It's really pretty and dainty. Um, I don't need to know what else to tell you about that. And there are earrings, but I have a couple different, two different sets of earrings. And I don't know which one is meant to go with that one, actually. There's these little buggers. And these are Bohemian Garnet Glass. You can tell by the table on the top. The table on the top. I think these are not meant to be bohemian glass because I don't think, I can't even tell, my eyes are bad. I'll have to get them underneath. These are a little more lap. Oh my God, I'm a frog. Even if, no, there's two of them. There's Sterling, gold wash. Let's look at this one again. Sings up. I might turn on the air after I said all that. Yeah, these are meant to be bohemian. Flat tip. Well, let me show you the difference. Can you see the difference? See the pointy and then the more not pointy? Kind of like bullet glass, you know what I'm saying? Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. I have these two. Not being sold together, but just happen to have two amaze balls. I mean, God. Let me put them on this thing for the big reveal. Do I have the proper bust in here? Not really. Look at this. Oh, it's so heavy. <laughs> I'm afraid to drop it. Am I right? Am I right? Oh my. These are all undyed. Cara. Well, I'll show them to you separate. Even if nobody else. Sterling finding. This one is just off the chain. I love flying saucer turquoise. That's not an official name. That's a Gina Gay name. And then this big bomber. If you love coral, these are for you. That's what I say. Unto you. And then this I got today. I love this piece. It reminds me of so many pieces. The combination of pieces I had when I was a kid. Um... You saw. Oh. Shh. Sorry. I think you saw this today. And it's going to fit a smaller wrist. I'm a six inch. I would think that's about perfect. If you're a six inch, get it off. 
There's the old Timex in it. I live for, oh, old Timex watches. Oh. And when I was probably, oh, 11, 10, 11, I had a Native American turquoise bracelet, right? And I kept it for years, right? And what do I keep saying, right? It had the green turquoise. You don't see green turquoise too often. But the bracelet that I had, oh my God, with the stamp, I'm so sorry. It had, so the, the green, it had a round green turquoise cab, right? It was cracked, always was, because unstabilized, right? And that was at, in, if I would have been like, say 10, 11, I would 1971, let's just say that date. It was already at least 30 years old before that, probably longer. And so anyways, but also the band, because I wore it so often, you know, it had the, you know, the kind of flat knot. I don't know why you guys care about any of this, but anyways, I would always like do that, like, you know, and it broke and I had it soldered. That's how much I loved that bracelet. Anyways, it's reminiscent. This, however, is a whole different thing. This is not a thin anything, whatever, like that one was. But it just reminisced me of my wee childhood. That's of my wee childhood. Okay. Even if no but. Okay, it's starting to get a little dicey warm in here. Dicey. So here's, I have this set. This is 1940s. Um... This is just glass. These are usually, I believe, I don't think this is a stone. This is what I call the bottle cap setting. Oopsie, oopsie. This is the necklace. It comes with a bracelet. It's too big for me. It's about seven and a quarter, seven and a half inch. And that's just kind of big on me. But I'm showing you that to show you this. This is a thing they did back then. This is mid-century Japan. Just put these pieces out. And I've had them in opaline. All of them. You know, I sang the songs that made the whole world cry. Oh, it's getting foofy in here. So, what is mine? Do I have a point here? It's either a set or separately. Because I know that not everybody wants both. I never do. Never, never do. Never do. Never do. Okay. Last but not least, certainly. This. Vahala. Right. Vintage sterling pen pendant. Amber. Really good size. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Just not mass produced stuff. Okay, I think that's it. I'm gonna, I think I'm going to turn the AC on. This came back to me. You know who let it come back to me? Thank you. You know who you are. Isn't it fantastic when you sell jewelry to friends and then you can maybe get them back? <laughs> that was about a year ago-ish. A little more maybe. doesn't matter. She came back to me. Oh, purple opaline. 1920s, I think. But Jen, if you watch this and you say something else, I usually go 1930s. I don't know by this. Who cares? I don't care. It's beautiful. Thank you for letting me have it back again. Oh, thank you. It's still lost on me as it ever was, but you know, hey. Hey now. Hey now. Hey now, don't dream it's over. I don't know if I'm selling this. I brought it out to do a compare, contrast and compare. So, yeah, I'm not sure. Anyways, okay, I'll put my email and I'll let you know if anything's just for auction or if it's for pre-sale as we go along. And what I say, I don't even want to clear all this out of here, so I'm not getting, I'm just going to leave it in here till tomorrow. <laughs> as I want to do. All right, thank you for watching. 
and set your buttons, set your alerts. They don't work really. They don't do any good, but you know, humor yourself and set your notifications for Taco Tuesday when I put the event up, which I'll probably do on Monday. I'll see you soon, real soon.